Hello, my name is Gus Henry, and this is my spring 2014 15 112 term project. It is Crappy Bird. Here's my code, and let's begin. When you start the game, it opens the splash screen where you have two options to either play a level or to open the level editor. We'll start by playing a level, and we'll click on level one. First, it opens the instructions, which are to defecate on cars and humans to gain points, avoid trees, hawks, and clouds to stay alive, and press the spacebar to begin, and also to defecate. When you start, you can see that as you hold any of the arrow keys, the bird accelerates in any direction up to a terminal velocity. When you press space, the bird defecates, and the point is to defecate on the targets below, and as you see in the top left corner, whenever you hit one, the score increases. You also have to avoid the obstacles. When you run into one, you lose the level. Now we'll go to level 2, which as you can see is a different level, yet everything works the exact same. In addition, we have the level editor. When you open either the game to play or the level editor to edit a level, it reads the levels from the level folder in the same directory as the crappybird.py file, reads each line and parses it accordingly in order to load the level. When we go into level one, for example, you can move obstacles around, such as the tree, which snaps to the bottom because trees don't float as well as the targets, or you can move the obstacles in the air around as well. To see how it saves, we will delete this storm cloud, and then put in a regular cloud, click save, go back, and play level one, and as you can see, the regular storm cloud is now at the beginning where we placed it. In addition, when you close out the file and reopen the program, and you go into play again, the, op the uh, options that you saved are exactly as they were before because it saves to an external file. The last part of the game is to reach the end of the level, which is similar to Super Mario in once you reach the home tree with the birdhouse, you have finished the level. At which point you can click to go back to the levels to pick a different level to play or go back and edit a different level. And that is it. I hope you enjoyed.